The second thing that we set out to do, which is what the Indian Cancer Society has been doing for over 60, 70 years now, and we continue to do, is arranging for patients to be seen. They're not patients at the time. They are lay people to be seen and for doctors to determine whether there is any risk factor in their life which could indicate cancer in a, at a later stage. So we do camps where we go out again to groups of people and to examine them with qualified doctors. And these doctors try and see whether there is any sign of cancer, of impending cancer in their lives. So this we call screening camps. And the third activity that we do is if we do find any suspicious cases, to try and get them to go to a qualified medical institution where they, their disease can be dealt with. And that is done by literal hand-holding because I described the effect of a cancer diagnosis on so there's reluctance, if a diagnosis is made, there's reluctance to, to go for further treatment. Here we counsel them, we deal with their mental fears, their psychological fears, and we handhold them until they begin to take their treatment.